Good morning! I'm like never up this early, so this is pretty impressive. Got up before six. There's some deer walking right outside of my Jeep this morning. Kind of cool. So I'm gonna get a early start. Oh my goodness, I'm surrounded by deer. Check it. Two there. Another over there. So this is the road that brings me to Obstruction Point. Obstruction Point is my trailhead. It's about an eight mile road. This guy, he just started walking away. He was just walking right towards me. You can kind of see the snowy peaks in the distance. A little bit of glacial views. You know, this would be so beautiful, I'm sure, without the uh, haze, but it's still pretty in its own way. Breakfast this morning, banana with peanut butter, oh yeah. Look at it out here, I had to stop in the road. It's getting a great view. Ooh, some good high country. I had no idea it was like this in Olympia, in Olympic. All right. All right. Well, I made it to my trailhead. Parking lot is totally full. I got the last parking spot in the actual lot. Look at this. Figured down that gravel road, there'd be barely anyone. Especially this early in the morning. Got my pack on, and I'm ready to start the trail. Let's do this. All right, so this is what I'm doing. Starting here, I'm parked right up here. I'm gonna hike down this way and clamp at Gladys Lake right over here. So it's about almost five miles getting there. Shouldn't be too bad. It's about 7.30 right now. I got a great head start. Just walking down from the high point. Pretty rocky. You can see the switchbacks. Follow. Pew, 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 pew. Trail goes all the way out there. Yeah. It's actually way clearer than I thought it'd be. Ooh, look at this. Some bees doing their work. Thank you, bees. I'm a fan of your work. Wow, I'm getting a bunch of different landscapes in this hike. Went from the rock and cliffs to the meadows. Now we're in some woods. Mmm. And it smells so good. I just descended about 2,000 feet from the trailhead and I've made it to the, the lowest points of the trail. And now I'm going up about 1,500 feet until I get to Gladys Lake. This is a good place to stop for a break. Nice little waterfall down there. I'm out here at Grand Lake. I figured I'd check out the lake. Met a couple guys on the trail who were camping out. I think that's them uh, camping out over there actually. Their names are Jonah and Zeke. And uh, they were filling up water yesterday in this. And after they felt the temperature of the water, they said it was super warm. Great for taking a dip in. Where there's Moose Lake is the next one down. And then mine is Gladys Lake, which is barely a lake. The haze isn't too bad though today. You can actually see the color blue in the sky. Awesome. Just found a good spot to take a break, sit here. I got nothing but elevation until I get there. Made it to Moose Lake. 
Another really pretty lake. All right, the next one should be mine, Gladys. I made it to the bare wire of Gladys Lake. Just getting all my uh, food and stuff, scented items, so I can hang it up here. Never seen anything like this. It's kind of like a uh, braided wire with some clips on the end of it. That's pretty handy. And it's like a pulley, you just pull it right up. So I'm gonna have a little snack break, hang my food, and then go find a place to set up camp. Here's the runoff from Gladys Lake into Moose Lake. Nice little stream right next to my campsite. Perfect. Already got my hair wet and stuff. Felt good. It's good temperature. Awesome. Well, I found a, a campsite that's not taken. So I'm taking it. Campsite number two. Um, it's got a great shore of the lake. I mean, it's not really a lake. It's very shallow. So I might dip my feet in. I could walk across it without getting up to my knees, I'm sure. There's a stream right down the way that I crossed on the way here. Uh, a couple that I passed on the way here stayed right up there. And uh, they highly recommended it. They said there are panoramic views. Uh, you can see Mount Olympus from there. Sounded like it's about 800 feet ascent. So that's doable. So I'm gonna do that after I get everything uh, established in the camp set. Now that everything in my tent is all set up, got my solar charger charging. I'm gonna go check this situation out with the panoramic views up there. See what it's like.